another Republican enters the race. Last night, former Pennsylvania Senator Rick Santorum announced his candidacy for President of the United States from his hometown in Pennsylvania. I am proud to stand here among you and for you, the American workers who have sacrificed so much to announce that I am running for President of the United States. Working families don't need another president tied to big government or big money. And today is the day, today is the day we are going to begin to fight back. It's critical that both our allies and our friends know what to expect from our next president. After 12 years of legislating and warning about the gathering storm of radical Islam, they know who I am and I know who they are. Rick Santorum gave his speech in a factory surrounded by the people he promised to fight for, the American worker. He promoted what he called his clear and conservative vision for America. He promised to reduce the size of government and roll back crippling regulations that not only hurt industry but increase unemployment. He called for a simplified tax code and promised to do away with the IRS. He vowed to defeat the Islamic State. He promised to uphold the sanctity of life. He asked for prayer for the spiritual awakening that will bring revival and healing to this nation. And he affirmed his belief in the sovereign God through whom all things are possible. This is Santorum's second run for the White House. He did fairly well in 2012. In fact, he exceeded expectations, winning 11 states in the primary and finishing second to Mitt Romney. This time around may prove more difficult with the current Republican field already a good size and expected to get even larger. Not to mention some of the strongest conservatives we've seen running in a long time, which will definitely up the ante. He'll have to gain traction quickly since only the top 10 candidates will participate in the first Republican debate later this year. Thanks for listening and be sure to catch the weekly Ray Warner Show and subscribe at iTunes or at the theraywarnershow.com.